Hey, it's me, it's BA, and well, since we are practically locked down, I decided to make more videos. I've been doing it for quite some time right now, but I haven't been so serious about it. Pero siguro ngayon, mas okay din na mag-video ko since wala akong social life, wala akong makausap, and I have a lot of tasks at hand. Um, surprisingly, mas busy ako ngayon since I have a lot of writing projects. Very fortunate ako dun sa part na yun, but I do acknowledge the fact na ang dami ngayong affected lalo na sa work, ang daming nawawalan ng trabaho or nagkakaroon ng pay cuts ang, ang daming affected and, and as much as I want to say that things will be back to normal I don't think it will be and sa dami ng tinusulat ko ngayon about coronavirus and podcasts about inspirational, motivational, whatnots meron ako talagang sobrang nagustuhan na sinulat ko lately I cannot quote that person right now so I'm just going to, to rephrase Ang sabi niya, we have a new reality and we have to change our routine. Sa totoo naman, itong coronavirus crisis na nangyayari sa atin, it will really change the reality that we have, okay? Sana for the better and hope for the better, mas, mas cautious tayo when it comes to health, mas alam na natin yung priorities natin in life, alam na natin kung what is enough alam na rin natin how to help other people and we know the importance of the frontliners kasi for the longest time parang hindi natin sila binibigyan ng halaga health insurance ano pa ba ang daming ang dami kong na-realize na pwede nating gawin inside our homes dahil nga ilang araw na tayong naka-quarantine alam mo yun nagigising kang creative like ako I have this list of what to do with my kids camping inside the house, cooking, doing math problems, creating our board games and all. To be honest, I am privileged dahil nga nasa bahay lang tayo. But I do hope and pray for those who are still going outside or still working and most especially those frontliners or yung sinasabi nga nila na backliners, agriculture. Sobrang na-appreciate ko. That, that's another thing. Sobrang gusto ko tuloy magtayo ng uh, garden. What's that? Vegetable garden. Alam mo yun, parang magandang ituro ulit yan sa mga bata. I remember when I was still in elementary, meron kaming subject na, or meron kaming class na magtatanim kami. Unfortunately, munggo na lang yung itatanim ko, hindi pa tumubo. Pero dapat ata ngayon, matutunan natin yan. Yung mga basic things. And I also have friends na, I would say, privileged. Or talagang may kaya. But right now, they're doing their house chores, and they're um, spending more time with their families. So, as much as I want to, you know, um, curse this coronavirus, we have to hope and to see, as cliche as this may sound, we have to see the brighter side of things for now. Because worrying will not get us anywhere. But instead, we have to prepare for the future or for what's in store for all of us. And yun nga lang, sabi nga dun sa podcast na pinakinggan ko, if we lose hope, it's 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 hope is a powerful thing actually one of the presidents or well-known presidents in the u.s won just because of um, sheer hope and i i hope that such thing can happen in this type of uh, situation I'm, i've been talking for quite some time right now maybe i can squeeze in another video for tomorrow but I still have to work and I still have to go to the groceries because I'm the one who pass. Bye bye and please take care. Please stay safe.